Majority may be doing things that is not even meant for you. Your help is not coming from abroad, but it is coming from above. Hello everyone. You are welcome back once again to my channel. Thank you for your support so far. May the good Lord bless you all. You are new in my page. My name is Oluwada Milola Matthew. And in this place, you wake up smiling. You feel no hands. And your bondage will be removed. Matthew chapter 19, verse 5 says, Shall a man leave their family, and they will cleave to their wife, and two will become one. Asunder. Today I want to talk about the advantages and disadvantages of long distance. I read something on social media. Her husband traveled all abroad. They will not be able to hear from her husband. And financially, the lady she is not strong any longer. She needs to vacate her apartment. But the family of her husband are able to welcome her. As time goes so. Mother-in-law, she was not feel comfortable. Her father-in-law decided to rent an apartment for her outside. And he used to go and check her welfare. Although there is a child between them, the relationship between her and father-in-law becomes so strong. And one thing leads to the another. Both of them begin to have a sexual intercourse. And out of this scene, she got pregnant. The pregnant is about three to four months. Her husband that have traveled abroad for a long period just arrived. By the time she asked her husband, hey, do you cut off the communication between us? The, uh, her husband said, I have issues in abroad. I was being in prison. This is the reason you are not being able to get to me. Now she need an advice for people. What can I do? I'm already pregnant. For my father-in-law and now my husband that i thought that there is no more relationship between us he's back to the country when you look at this story it is all about distance in our relationship first i will talk about the advantages if you are alone without your partner you can pick several courses you can go to any joint any place Without any approval, you can do things on your own. You have enough of privacy. You may even decide to have a lesson then in your house. Maybe your room is clean or dirty. That will be for your own personal view. You don't need to wait for anyone to do anything. You have both nights. There is confidence for go extra mile. You can enter anywhere without even waiting for your spouse. A man will have confidence to cook their food, clean their house. They don't need to wait for anyone to come and wash their clothes. They become a better husband. They don't sit around the house from morning to evening, waiting for their wife to do everything. Number three, they will be able to cope even in the future without their partner. They may have a transfer in their working place. They may need to go to vacation in the future even without their spouse. They will not be feel lonely, depressed or sad. Be happy and have a fun life. There won't be your wife or your husband nagging or complaining about anything. 
they will be able to cover their floor. Loneliness kill faster than age. And a faithful partner, be separate. There won't be any enjoyment in it. There will be sadness, depression. Whenever they are doing their anniversary, especially the time they used to go for vacation. Lack of trust and misunderstanding when there is a distance between couples, especially when you are sending message or call, they will not be able to pick it up. Even if they are faithful partner, we start developing doubts, gradual separation, especially on faithful partner, they begin to see another lady, another man outside. The love, ties that is between them and their family, it's reducing. They begin to pick up a little fault that they used to neglect before. And if some misunderstanding, it is not Andrew. It is going to lead to divorce. Higher tendencies of cheating. See some faithful partner. By the time they separate for their family, they will not be able to endure because their body is requesting for what their wife and love can give to them. They will surely look for quick fix. Some Christians are backsliding in this area. Some of them developing in loving their new partner because it is wood that you are seeing daily, able to give you what your wife is giving to you. Some of them love their new partner, even more than their wife. Break up and divorce. Start gradually from their hearts. Advantages of long distance can be work on trusting each other and higher level of communication. And for those who cannot cope with long distance relationship, they should not function in needs. They should trail as much as possible to stick with your partner. Jesus has given me a goodie bag, yo. It's like the goodie bag, na blessing, yo. It's like the goodie bag, na favor. Anything I need, you will supply. <laughs> Miracle happens steady every day of my life. You know, you cannot stay away from sex for a month or completely one year. Why do you want your partner to leave you? To go on vacation, then you know that at the end of it, it is going to bring out a sad story. I encourage us that before we take any step, we should ask from God. If it is will of God for you to do it or not, majority may be doing things that is not even meant for you. Your help is not coming from abroad, but it is coming from above. Long distance relationship has break so many lovely hope. of my fewer that you are watching this program that God will sustain your home wine in your home will not dry up have a lovely day and if you are watching my program for the first time you have not surrendered your life to Jesus this is another opportunity have a glorious day and God bless you if you are watching my program and you have not subscribed don't forget to leave your comments like and also subscribe. I hope to see you next week. God bless you. Remain blessed. God has given me a duty bag, yo. Jesus has given me a duty bag, yo. Inside the goody bag, na blessing, yo. Inside the goody bag, na favor. Anything I need, you will supply. <laughs> Miracle happens steady every day of my life. I have a God who never fails. I have a God who never changes.